Beautiful. Whoa. This is actually a 24 brick rocket stove. And there's the uh, 20 brick rocket stove. Okay, and here's the 16 brick rocket stove. This is the one you see most commonly. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, fire it up here. I got a little pile of twigs and branches right there. I'm getting the fire started in there. Looking good. Got a good raging fire in there now. Got a couple eggs in there. Just like that, you're cooking. The fire gets funneled straight up under the pan so there's no loss of heat. Like a regular fire, you'd lose all the heat to the sides and you'd have to use a lot more wood to do something like this. Man, you couldn't ask for better. Okay, that was the 16 brick stove cooking the eggs. Now I'm going to cook some pork chops on a 20 brick stove. Looking good. Those are already half done. Look at that. That's the 20 brick rocket stove again. I'm going to now move up to the 24 brick rocket stove. You can use rocks or sticks or anything to hold the pan up in there. There's the 24 brick stove. Whoa, nice. There's enough room to drop stuff in from the top as well. And this is the 24 brick stove. So there's plenty of room for bigger pieces to fall in there. The flame stays right in the middle. Amazingly efficient. Keeps almost all the heat in there. Rises it up to the bottom of the pan. Water's boiling like crazy. Tons of coals in there now. You could probably cook a few other things in the cast iron frying pan without even restocking the wood now. And that's all I used. Cooking the twigs and bark and everything else. Beautiful. You can heat up almost anything in that. So there's the base of the stove. Just four full-size bricks and one half brick to make a square. Lay the second level on top of the first level exactly the same. Half brick, full brick. Brick on either side. Now, I really like this 24 brick one because maybe 24 is the way to go. You can put bigger pieces of wood in there. You really have to break the wood really small if you only use the 16 brick stove. If you do have a piece of wood, say, about that size, you could put it right down the center once you get a lot of coals in there. You could cook for like an hour on a wood piece of wood like that. Maybe two. I don't know. It just burns slowly. So I'm going to say go with the 24 brick stove. Maybe even 20, uh, 28, you know. Just keep adding four bricks at a time. See how it goes. 